कुणाल शाह ऑफ क्रेड रितेश अगरवाल ऑफ ओयो डॉक्टर देवी शेट्टी ऑफ नारायण चेन्ना हॉस्पिटल डॉक्टर के के अगरवाल हु इज अल कार्डियोलॉजिस्ट डू यू नो वट इज कॉमन बिटवीन ऑल ऑफ देम यू मस्ट हैव हर्ड ऑफ आई आई टीज आई एम्स एम्स जिपम वेल ऑफकोर्स यू हैव नन ऑफ दी अबाउट सेट सक्सेसफुल पीपल आर फ्रॉम एनी ऑफ दिस ब्रांड इंस्टीट्यूशन मोस्ट ऑफ दी यू वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो विल नॉट एंड अप इन वन ऑफ दिस प्रेमे इंस्टीट्यूशन एंड दैट इज ओके दीज सक्सेसफुल पीपल फ्रॉम ऑल ऑफ दिस प्रेमे इंस्टीट्यूशन प्रूव दैट यू आर नॉट अ फेलियर इट प्रूव दैट यू आर नॉट यूजलेस Today I am going to tell you about India's most underrated medical college that not only gives you great medical education great medical exposure but also gives you an active social life Hey friends welcome back to the channel I'm Dr Anirudh Bhatt and today I'll be giving you four indisputable reasons of why you're missing out on India's most underrated medical college that is Goa Medical College Can you imagine telling your friends that you're also having fun and becoming a doctor in the party capital of India that is Goa और आशीष कोवा के प्लान के लिए रेडी Give me a few more moments of your time and I will convince you why you should take admission into this college of mine. All the work and no fun make Jack a dull boy. We have all heard of this statement in our childhood. Coming to the doctor scenario in this country, we all know how much levels of depression, suicide and record levels of burnout doctors are facing over here in India, especially after the COVID-19 pandemic. To combat this work stress, we need a perfect mix of academics as well as social life and Goa Medical College caters to exactly this need. Goa is a party destination. We have clubs, we have beaches, we have good restaurants serving you Japanese, Thai, French, German cuisine, you name it, we have the restaurant over here in Goa. Imagine after a tough MBBS viva and talk to any doctor, they will tell you there are at least hundreds of tests, vivas, research paper, academic articles that we'll have to do during our entire MBBS course. Imagine after going through so much of work, getting the reward by going to a beach, having a nice swim and later on in the evening chilling at a nice cozy cafe somewhere in the heart of the city of Goa. This is what I'm talking about, where you your efforts will be rewarded in terms of unlimited amounts of entertainment and you know the best part about goa all of these fun activities are just a few kilometers away from the medical college these options for stress busters are only available uniquely to goa which makes this an ideal place if you're looking for academics as well as social life if you speak to your engineering friend during your entire need preparation they will tell you that government has opened so many new iits but not all the facilities the research labs as well as the professors are all competent in these particular new iits this is also true about some of our own medical colleges unfortunately but in goa medical college you have an unfair advantage goa medical college is the only tertiary government level hospital in the entire state of goa so that means right from the most basic places of flu cold fever right up till complex endocrine disorders autoimmune conditions cancer treatment cardiology we have all the departments fully functional in goa medical college so you will be seeing the commonest complaints in the entire population as well as you will be seeing some specialty level of diseases so the level of exposure when there's only one big government hospital catering to the entire state can you imagine the level of patient exposure you'll be getting over here in goa i remember in my final year of mbbs there was one case of a lady who had takatsuba cardiomyopathy the heart becomes like a japanese jar and this happens because of a tacky arrhythmia that happens to the heart when there is a condition called as hyperthyroidism now such special cases you may see only in a very well established cardiology hospital but i got to see this over here right in goa medical college and that's the advantage even the rarest of the rare cases in the entire state of goa get referred to gmc if you go on cora and you see some answers by different medicos they will say that it is extremely competitive to get a patient uh, in some hospital they don't even have one student for one bed there be five six students on one bed taking history and examining the patient and we all know so many doctors around the patient just ends up making the patient more anxious and more stressed out and it is not really an effective way of teaching students but in goa because of so many general wards so many surgery wards you will be guaranteed that there will be one bed per student and not only that one student will see so many variety of cases that you will get a good clinical acumen by the time you're out as an mbbs doctor you'll be 
spending your entire time with the patient, one hours, two hours, three hours, you name it. You are literally the boss of the hospital if you have a learning attitude. Now tell me one thing, if there is one tertiary hospital in the entire state, it is bound to be famous, it is bound to have some of the latest technologies that a government can afford. So why wouldn't it be the case that the best doctors in the entire state would want to come as a consultant in these hospitals? The third reason why you should come to Goa Medical College is because you have experienced doctors over here. The doctors in GMC are famous throughout the entire state. They are well experienced. They know people from various socioeconomic strata and they will give you a more holistic picture of what is practically applicable from what we actually study in the textbooks. For example, my very favorite doctor Dr. Edwin is famous throughout the state. Each and every single person in a nook and corner of the state knows Dr. Edwin also because of his heroic work during the COVID-19 pandemic where he was one of the very few doctors who went out of his comfort zone and actually treated patients symptomatically according to the developing protocol during COVID-19 and he was like a state hero literally overnight. So you get to experience from such great people in Goa Medical College and this is only possible because we have one tertiary care hospital in the entire state. These experienced doctors have also dealt with all kinds of students in their entire consultant life. So they know how to explain to you the most complex of diseases. It is up to you ultimately to ask questions. Yes, sometimes you may get scolded upon by asking them lame questions, but that is part of the learning process. And they will understand if you are asking such dumb questions because even they've been students in Goa itself and now they are consultants in the same college. So there is this amount of understanding and bonding that happens in Goa Medical College. And because of a variety of doctors, they have different personalities. So you will understand how to be diplomatic, how to manage people's egos, how to manage your name and fame in the hospital itself. These are the essential life skills that you may not get in say a city hospital like Mumbai or Bangalore where a few years later on you will go from that place and you will not be within the same ecosystem. Being in the same ecosystem teaches you some skills like diplomacy, like handling different people, like convincing skills which you will learn only in Goa Medical college. Now because of Goa Medical College being the only tertiary hospital, I'm repeating this point for the end time because this is so important and there are advantages to having only one medical college in the entire state, you will develop connections. It is very easy for yourself to promote yourself among your seniors, your juniors and the consultants. Because it's a tight knit ecosystem of say around 1000 doctors, if you try to do something different, if you try to do something unique or you excel in your academics or your social life, you'll be easily recognized by the consultants your juniors and your seniors and that is a huge advantage because as we all know in the 21st century your network is your network the most successful doctors may not be the most knowledgeable ones but they are the ones who have maximum connections if there is a surgeon and he has connections with the best anesthetist with the best ortho guy with the best trauma care person with the best equipment salesperson you can be sure that even though he has an ms degree compared to his colleague but he has these connections he is going to be a more successful surgeon and then Therefore, if you plan to come to Goa Medical College and if you stand out in the crowd, it is much much more easy for you to make your unique identity. The fourth reason why you should come to Goa Medical College is because of the active extracurricular activities, freedoms and the various vibes you get in Goa. So we have a very active quizzing club, we have dance club, we have a fitness club, we have a film society, we have a poet club and so many other extracurricular activities that go on. We also have a university cricket ground and an athletic stadium for all our intersports activities and trust me the intersame sports activities is literally the highlight of the entire year. We also host our annual functions, sports, award ceremony, freshers and our very own conference called as GOMECCON each and every single year. So trust me each and every single month, each and every single week there is something to do in GMC that will keep your entire personality in check. Talking about the vibe of GMC and this is very very important for us as doctors to be close to nature because when when you look at nature, that is when the most de-stressing actually happens for me and for my friends as well. When you move through GMC, there are these humongous trees trees that have been there since so many years and they give rise to so many different colors of flowers from green to red. During the spring and the rainy season you have amazingly fresh looks of the trees as if they are so happy and it is very very cute to walk through this entire GMC campus in the rainy season. Of course we do get our fair share of heavy rains but after the rains and just before it starts raining the vibe is very cool, the vibe is very chill and you can enjoy your Maggie, your coffee, your tea 
and it is literally the perfect environment in Goa. A very important update is a new super speciality block. We did not have this super speciality block in GMC and now it is literally looks like a five star hospital and it overlooks the beautiful Arabian Sea. So the rumor is that the patient as soon as he walks into this super speciality block will get cured immediately just because of the aesthetics and the looks that the patient gets when he or she sees outside the ward window. So overall in Goa, inside campus and outside campus, you have fun activities, you have activities that de-stress you, that add to your personality and if you are a person who is into studies and will study and will later on enjoy also in the evenings, Goa Medical College is the best college for you. So that's it guys for this video. I hope I have justified why Goa Medical College remains one of the most underrated medical colleges in the entire country and if you want to know how you can get into Goa Medical College, what are the cutoffs, what are the requirements, how you can vibe and be a part of this Goan culture. I've already made a video which I will link somewhere over here or on the screen. Do watch that video. Comment down in the comment section below whether you're excited to come to Goa Medical College. What are your experiences of Goa Medical College? And if you want me to address any other issue about Goa Medical College, let me know down in the comment section below. If you want to plan your Goa trip along with your friends and actually get the permission of your parents to do so, the best way is to answer the NEET UG exam. Come to Goa Medical College and come meet me for a cup of coffee and I will guide you through the entire medical college so that you not only take good academics but wonderful memories back with you. Until the next video, see you, bye bye.